Man, it's windy today. Hanging out with Deep Honey. We're gonna go to JC Town. We're on a mission, Deep Honey. What are we? What are we getting? Some stuff. <laughs> We're getting some stuff. And it's windy. I'm cold, dude. My hands are numb. But I will catch you guys when we get there. All right, here we are. JC Penny, baby. Let's go. <laughs> accomplished yo we got our stuff ready to rock and roll guys we'll see you when we uh uh get ready all right we're ready to rock and it's so windy there's the heat in and the money hang out guys see you Excited, nice. Very excited. Yeah, we're gonna be here, guys. We're creepy, and we're watching from the sidewalk. But that's EJ and Nick, and they're getting married today. <laughs> we're just literally on the sidewalk. <laughs> oh, oh, that was cute. Oh, this is a turn. Oh. the party ladies and gentlemen with money and yeah the ceremony's gonna happen there that's the guy yo <gasps> it's happening My cousin, bro. Hell yeah. I'm for you, bro. Well, I want to welcome all of the family and friends of Emmanuel Suarez and Nicholas Wilson on this happy occasion. Just gonna find these. Oh, they're right here. Cool. Okay. So, Emmanuel, there is like nothing that I could tell you right now that you don't already know. Um, I said I've never said I would never say it to anyone before, but you know me better than I know myself. Um, you know what I like and what I don't, what matters to me, what doesn't. Um, but, uh, sorry. And that, like, you know what I'm gonna say before I say it? And that drives me absolutely bonkers. Um, but at the same time, with you, I continue to grow. Uh, surface level things like uh, finally watching Avatar The Last Airbender and <laughs> enjoying Star Wars, really. Um, new experiences like bouldering, skydiving, and eventually climbing Mount Adams when we finally do that. Um, and deeper things like actually learning how to listen, uh, respecting boundaries, and embracing a new family dynamic. Uh, but with so many differences, we also have so much the same. We love going to the gym, but also love taking out on junk food. Uh, we are both really are willing to uh, do pretty much anything, uh, like our surprise date to the Church of Scientology, like in the first <laughs> month, <laughs> um, and the ability to like laugh about anything. Uh, you've gotten me through one of the toughest times in my life, um, and really helped me heal from that. 
Um, I don't think I tell you how much, or enough, how much I appreciate you for that. Um, when we met, I was only supposed to be here for a few months, and uh, this wasn't supposed to be anything serious. Um, but then some stuff uh, went down, and you were there for me. Um, and even though my mom isn't here today, uh, she's really a big part of our relationship, and therefore she's, she's here with this marriage. Um, I also don't know anybody who would be able to take my dead mom jokes as much as you do, so I really appreciate that. Uh, but, like I said, she was a big part of this relationship, and I know that she would be happy to be here today, and she would be, she would approve. Um, anyway, so these are supposed to be more than just, uh, what I, what makes us work and what I like about you. Uh, these are supposed to be my vows, and so as such, um, I vow to continue to share myself with you, more of myself, um, and appreciate you more and more for who you are. Um, I vow to continue to grow with you, grow together, and hopefully help you grow as well. I vow to continue to try new things with you, like finally climbing Mount Adams. Uh, continue to follow the gym with fried chicken or chips and queso with you. Um, and continue to laugh with you about whatever life throws at us. Um, I vow to commit to loving you for the rest of my life unconditionally. I don't know what the future holds, but I do know that in Tagalog, Mahalakita, in English, I love you, in Phineas and Ferb, Gitchi Gitchi Q, and in Canadian, here is some poutine. Great. Okay, Emmanuel, it's your turn. Let's go, boy. Oh, God. I'm... <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So, um, three months into dating Nick, I. I was crazy, I already fell in love with him. Um, and I, he was going to move to Mexico. And I wrote him a rap <laughs> to, to, to his favorite song, Buster Move. <laughs> and um, telling him not to move. Um, I'm not gonna rap that one because that was, that's expired now. Um, but I did write him a, another rap. Oh, dude. <laughs> Oh yeah! The best to move. Um, so I'm gonna play it right now. Can you guys? Best to move. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> This year's my vow for you, special fellow. Words can't describe how much I love ya. If you can't tell, I'm overzealous. Dropping my vows, please don't think I'm careless. Okay, cutie, our love story started off when you swiped right on me. We had our first kiss on our first date. Seeing you the next day, I could not wait. Third date function. We were munching. Thanksgiving with your fam, a great introduction. Met your family on date number three. From then I knew we were meant to be. Hey. You got a big heart, funny and smart. Oh yeah, you're handsome. That's the best part. The guy in my dreams here, my group. Glad I swipe back. Swipe back. Thanks for making a move. Um, but on a serious note, um, I vow to love you more than I have loved uh, you these past couple of years. I vow to always understand and give you space and listen to you when you are ready to talk. I vow to never go to bed upset with you. I, vo I vow to always laugh at your jokes. I vow to always <laughs> double check for your wallet, keys, and anything you may have forgotten before we leave the house. <laughs> I vow to always get your protein shake and pre-workout ready before the gym. <laughs> I vow to start actually walking Danny out for a walk in the morning <laughs> instead of lying about it. <laughs> um, I vow to love you even on the hardest days when it's hard to love you. I vow to be a safe space for you even when we don't like each other on that day. I vow to continue to grow, learn with you, and learn from you. I vow to love you till the end of our days and all of our lifetime. Even when I'm brought back as a bug or a bird or a tree in our next life, I will find you and love you. <laughs> all right, Liam Leeson. Shit. Nice. That's a 
amazing. <laughs> so uh, now I'd like for you two to join hands, please. Emmanuel, you take Nicholas to be your lawfully wedded husband in good times and bad, in good health and, and bad health, and until death you do part. Nicholas, you take Emmanuel to be your lawfully wedded husband in good times and bad, in sickness and in health, until death you do part. Okay. Emmanuel and Nicholas have chosen to seal their wedding promises to, and to symbolize their desire to be faithful to one another uh, by exchanging rings and this will lock in their unending commitment. Nicholas, please put the ring on Emmanuel. So now, by the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church in the state of Washington, I pronounce you husband and husband. Next time on the Vloggity. Okay, we actually got Yeah, I guess we're not that uh we're not done yet. We're drunk. But we're gonna do this.